Hello, it's Jeffrey with Real Nifty Vintage, and today we are here at the Marine Flea Market, and I'm really excited to go in and see what I can find, and we're here bright and early at 9 a.m. Just a few more minutes to go, and then I will get out. There's currently a line of three men in their 60s. They just opened the doors, and I'm headed over here to this glass. This is where I find a lot of good stuff, ironically. I feel like I have to look very quickly because I want to get everywhere before everybody else <laughs> the game. So I'm just glancing for like main thing. Ooh, let me try that. I'm glancing for the, the main things. And then I'll come back and I'll do like, you know, I'll, I'll look harder. I'll look deeper once I get through all the main things. The obvious things, I should say. So we'll go ahead and get these two and put them on the table. Put them on the table, Mabel. We'll look at those two. All right, let's continue. We'll look at all these little figurines now. That's interesting. A dollar? Wow. Here's a little cat. That's a nice Siamese cat. And I like this dolphin right here too. Blown glass. So I'm gonna get that as well. Then we're gonna go down the middle. Well, the middle aisle is very busy. Then we'll, then I don't know what we'll do. Figurines. See, that's broken. Ooh. Is that an August angel? It's been broken on the back, the wing. Um, it's left and I'm gonna get it anyway because it's just the wing and a dollar is pretty cheap for that. So, I'm gonna get the, the left and angel. All right, over here we have some Wonder Lear bowls. These are Tupperware. They don't have their lids though. It's a mixing bowl set. And there's a couple that they're, ooh, ooh, wow. There's a couple that they're missing, by the way. It would be like a couple larger ones. That's cool. Needs a lid. It's large though. I don't really wanna ship that large thing. Hmm. Hey, there's some nice things. Let's go down the middle aisle now. I think we can. That's a cool planter. A dollar. I, I can't help myself for a dollar. Might as well. So we'll add that to the pile. All right, now we're gonna go down the center aisle. Which is this way. Okay. Let's see. A vacuum cleaner. Mushroom thing. License plates. Shoes? Oh no, there's like Nerf guns. A Teletubby. A Viewmaster. For two. Teletubby, that's funny though. All right, let's keep going. Oh. That's cute, little personal TV tray for two. Hmm, there's a lot of like rust and stuff on it, like little dots. I don't think I will. Okay, we're gonna look back here now. Oh, those are fun. Holds all of your, oh, all of your nails. It's a cat. A ball jar with a zinc top lid for four dollars with potpourri inside. A little Holland piece. Hmm. Hmm. Box. That's adorable. Two dollars. Well, I can't miss that. Isn't that awesome? It's a little dusty, but that's about it. It's really nice. Oh, there's all these figurines over here. Oh my goodness gracious. Dalmatian. That's a shaker. 
cardinal music. Hmm, a pig. Let's look at this pig. Pig. Oh, I think it's part of a pig family. It has a little wire on the side of it. Ooh. That's Linux. I like the, the necklace. I'm gonna get that. It's a Joseph original cat. Is this one also a Joseph? I don't think it is. No, that's Lefton. Oh, I like that though. Oh, there's another Linux. Run out of hands. Yikes. Let's go back here. This is where they have some of their long standing items. So, all of this is three for a dollar, any dish. Any dish you'd like. Okay, there's a Salem Biscayne glass in the blue. Just one, though. So, you can get three glasses for a dollar. I haven't really found a whole lot of glasses in here. It's been a long time since I have. They have nicer glassware over here, some pressed glass. That is the Mesa pattern by Federal Glass. And the two casseroles and that. And there's a peach luster, also Federal. It's a pie pan. Green planter. Who made you? I don't know. Maybe anchor hawking. Some ruby teacups. Opal glass. There's a milk glass grape pattern and a couple other vases. All right, so we all know how much I love the crab bags. They've got all of these and all of those down there. Oh my gosh, they're really overflowing with grab bags. I feel like I need to help them out. Three dollars each. Okay. Well, there's that one. It says tea bag holder. There's some fans in there. There's like a little sailor boy. <laughs> okay, I'll get that one. So they're, like I said, they're $3 each. So, I mean, really, that's not bad. There's a deer. I think I'll get that one. And there's this one. No, I won't get that one either. Those have like beanie babies on them. Those have, those are toys, figurines, uh, dog, dog's yeah. vases. I won't get that one either. All right, I'm gonna keep looking at these and I'll, I'll let you know if I find any more. All right, I like this one too. So it has some like California raisin. It has, I think, a, it looks like the back of a squirrel with a tennis racket, maybe a single shaker. There's a planter here made in Japan. It's, um, oh, there's a, a plastic deer, a little Japan. That one looks good. I'm gonna get that one. Get in the, get on the floor. Um, yeah, there's, there's some pretty good ones, but, mm, no. Oh, look at the little cat in there. Oh, there's another cat down there. Oh, that's adorable. So there's the two little cats. And then there's, oh, Native American. Oh, I'm gonna, Mm, there's, there's a giant dolphin. Uh, a couple of rust figurines from the 80s or so. Um, I don't think I will. I was so close to getting that one. And then lastly, this one. Nope, I won't get that one either. All right, that's enough. There's a doll head in there. Okay, let's go. Tupperware. I don't like any of that Tupperware. Over here, I don't see much. Lots of large things like horse yokes and little carriers and a Mickey Mouse phone. So then, let's see, we'll continue around this corner. A couple trash cans. Okay, this is where we all started. Now I can come over and take a look. That is a, wait a minute, it's upside down. <laughs> it's a refrigerator dish. Um, Okay, this is a pretty common one with the vegetables on top of it. Uh, I have a blue lid at home that I could technically make a marriage out of it, but I'm, I'm not, I don't want to. 
I really need to find the cobalt bottom because it's been in my window for like two years now. Just as a sun catcher. It's a hazel atlas crisscross lid that I have. Here's one of these Miracle Maze, they're cornbread molds. They made them in glass and they also made them in cast iron. This is a glass one. And it's the Miracle Maze. I'm gonna get that actually. It looks like it's in good shape. It's a good heavy chunky glass for three dollars. So there's that. Is that a lid? What is it's a plate. That's the Biscayne by Salem. I don't know, they just had it sitting there. Couple dishes. Anchor Hawking. What is this one? This one might be like a Mexico. No, that's Anchor Hawking as well, the casserole. And there's that pie dish down there painted. A celery dish. Another celery dish there, and the avocado green. Some little, also anchor, ho anchor hawking. A log planter. I don't see any markings on it. That's a nice log planter though. I'm gonna get that. It's, it's ceramic. And this is where we started over here, so I'm gonna take a look at it a little bit, a little bit more in depthly, in depthly. Those are made in Japan plates. Some bottles. Um, an Italian woven basket. Stoneware. Those are false graph. That's not a bad price. Four dollars. Those are for all of those. those are, that's good. This plate is a little bit worn. The cowboy plate for two dollars. That's Hazel Atlas for two dollars. Let's look down in the down in the. Let's look in the. Let's look in the furniture area right now. So there's oh things have changed. That's always a good thing. A cot. There's a cot. There's a bench. I don't think I need any furniture. Oh, that's a nice chair. Look at this chair. Put that in like a study, like a library. 55, little hole. Boop, boop. A jar. Noon. What is that? Noon hour? No, it doesn't make sense. Noon. I don't know. I don't know what it says, but it's a coffee thing. Oh, that's fun. State Farm Road Maps. A dog. Oh, that's a big flashlight. Wow. All right, um, ooh, the fabric looks good. Let's look at the fabric, it looks refreshed. Eh, can't go that way, gotta go this way. Okay, so there's a Roseanne Afghan. <laughs> That's a cool one right here. The colors on you are beautiful. $3, ooh, think about Halloween. What do we think about such a thing? I like it. Do I want that? I think I do. I think I'll open it up too to make sure. Oh, I bet I like that. I bet that I like that a lot. Okay. Um, anything else? Yeah, no? Probably not. No. No. Oh yeah, I'm gonna open this up and make sure I like it. There it is, that's what it looks like. On screen, it's a little bit washed out, but in person, this is like a pumpkin orange. Pumpkin orange, chocolate brown. Looks like candy corn. 
Yep, it looks good. And there's like a little diamond. Diamond points. I'm gonna get you. I decided to look over here once more and I just noticed this cow creamer. Hand-painted Holland. So I have to get that. People love those cow creamers. I don't see any issues with it either. So we'll get that. And then I noticed this planter here. And it's left in. So that's exciting. That that one back there is a made in Brazil one. And I don't I don't prefer to buy made in Brazil figures. Nothing against Brazil. It's just uh the I don't know, the style and age aren't really exciting to me. So I don't do it. I don't do it. No. All right, I'm in the dollar section one more time, and I noticed this little chalkware plaque with a bird on it. So it's a dollar. This might be Miller Studios. It reminds me of stuff they do. Oh, yeah, there it is. 1970. You see it on the side? A lot of the Miller Studios stuff is signed right along the edge. So that says 19... Mm. It's not focusing. There you go. 1970 Miller Studio. And then... I found this little squirrel. It needs to be cleaned, but it was only a dollar. Once it's cleaned up, it's gonna look beautiful. You're gonna look beautiful. You are. Okay, right, look at those two things. Oh boy. Yep, I think we're about done. I don't see much over here unless I want a popcorn maker or another Mr. Coffee. Easy clean waffle baker. No. No. Ooh, I like that. I don't know how old that is. Hmm, it's pretty green. I don't think those things are too old. Little little lights. Let's look out together. Let's look at these together. This shade is plastic. Hey. It's kinda cheapy. I can just tell. You're kinda cheapy. All right, I think we're good. We looked at the dollar section. I don't see much here today. Oh, that's kind of different. That little pop there with the blue. Hmm. Uh, well, that's a lot of coffee pots, goodness gracious. <laughs> you, you ever think of, you know, like how people do weddings and they always use milk glass faces. Why not use <laughs> coffee pots? Where you have like a coffee pot on every on every table, and it's filled with flowers, and it's filled with flowers. Wait a minute, there's a couple tins up here that might be good. Okay, I no nah, that one no. This one though. Let's look at you. Oh, you don't have a lid. The pictures on it's cool, but no lid. No lid, no sale. All right, don't forget my little squirrel. All right, let's go. I did get a box full of stuff here and I'm really excited about it. So I did add a few things as well, uh, like uh, this here for a dollar. So I, I added this, I like it. I bought one of these before. The other one that I sold didn't do tremendously amazing, but I don't care. So I like the way that it looks. I just like this. So I wanted to buy it for a dollar. And it's just nice, it's like a bamboo basket. So I got that. And then the other thing that I added, I forgot. <laughs> Maybe, well here, look, I'll just show you. So the box is right over here. I don't know if I added anything that you didn't see. Most of the stuff was in, captured. I got like the accordion thing. These are good. People like those, the accordion wall hangers. You could put mugs on them, scarves, hats. And there's the rest of my stuff. Yes, it's just set in there nicely. No paper paper adds to the trouble of unwrapping it. I have good luck with, with things like this. You put heavy things on the bottom, lightweight things on the top. That's how you do it. Uh, so that is my, that is my, my stuff that I got. Uh, in total, about $43 worth right here. And then the blanket on the bottom. There you are, blanket. You look so beautiful. Yes. Yes, you do. Whoa. So yeah, I did. I found a lot of great things and I'm happy. So I'm gonna wrap up this video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.
Bye-bye.